Hello everyone, welcome back to Wet Knowledge. Please subscribe the channel. Today I am having newly launched Grand Steam Hotel IP phone which is GHP630W and I am going to log in it with the default password. The default password is mentioned behind the sticker on the phone. Now I'm changing the default password. Now this phone has two SIP accounts, so you can register with two PBXs or two different SIP accounts. This phone has uh, four models and two color variant. One is white and one is black. The white variant has two models, one with PoE and one with Wi-Fi option. Similarly, the black phone has also the same option, one with PoE, one with Wi-Fi. Now, I am going to register this phone with the UCM PBX through the first option, which is manually configuring the extension in the hotel IP phone. So, I am first changing the extension password in the UCM extension side. And now, applying changes once the apply change is done we'll start configuring hotel phone manually so in the first account i am enabling account active and giving account name and sip server the ip address of ucm now in the sip user id and authentication id field I am giving extension number and in the authentication password I am entering 1234 which we have said in UCM. Now the registration is done and we can check in the status account status option. So the phone is registered and as well we can check from the UCM side. So as the phone is registered we have to done we have to done some specific changes in the codex setting so the by default all the codex are selected we have to remove unnecessary codex which create the audio issue in the phone so we have to select only pcmu pcma and 7 to 9 and remove all other codex as well enable first matching vocoder in 200 ok stp so here we can change the switching of account so this way we have registered manually now I'll show you how to register second way and that is auto provisioning from the UCM side without logging the IP phone so I'm going into the zero config option and you can see the phone is auto detected but the model is not detected so we have to download the package of this ip phone from model update and click on update download so the pbx must have internet so that it can detect model update packages and if the UCM does not have internet, these packages will not be seen here. You, and then you have to manually upload the package from the GrassIM side. So now the package is downloaded successfully. We'll move to zero config and editing the phone and selecting the model. now i'm enabling first account and selecting extension but the extension is not in uh, able to select here so there must be some issue so i'm cancelling it and deleting and now i'll auto discover and selecting the sip message so that the pbx discover automatically with phone model now select the ip address and click ok
it takes few seconds and showing the result now you can see the model is detected here now edit it and enable account one now we select extension 903 and click on update so the configuration push to the phone automatically so now we can check in the phone and you can see the phone is registered successfully with the auto provisioning so this phone has multiple features and we can configure it through the wi-fi as well and we can configure the ethernet settings so now we will move to the multi-purpose keys option and multi-purpose keys we have multiple options like speed dial and other features i'll show you and the logo can be changed here so in the field of value we'll put the extension number so the name as well is customizable like front desk rep wake up restaurant cleaning service and emergency and the modes are dtml speed dial gds open door voicemail and uh, etc now i'll save now we have as well option of speed dialing so the keys starting from 1 to 9 and star and has can be programmed as speed dialing and this speed dial works when you press long then speed dial works so i set one number key as a speed dial for 902 extension and giving a name now save and apply So uh, you need to set uh, your time zone accordingly and make sure you have NTP enabled or your phone should have internet connectivity so that it can get the time from the NTP server. Now we have LCD option, we can increase decrease the brightness, we can upload wallpaper from the web UI or through the URL push. We have a screen saver as well and we can push through the URL through the screen saver path. Now we have audio control as well. We can increase the sound or decrease. We can lock speaker volume. We can enable the TX gain and this phone is as well compatible with hearing aid compatibility. So we can uh, upgrade this phone through the HTTP manually upload or through the GDMS. This phone supports provisioning and factory set from the web UI. Now in the hotel services, we can give hotel name, hotel address and the other details. And these details will be shown on the display of the IP phone. This phone supports emergency services, web services and GDS. So it can integrate with the GDS and up to 10 GDS can be connected. So you can open the door lock from the configuring this setting. So this phone has multiple options like account sharing, contacts and call history. So you can see the call history of the phone. And now I'm going to show you the call from my Wave application to this phone. So I'm dialing extension 903 from Wave extension. The hotel phone is ringing. And now the call is answered by the hotel phone and the speech is going on. Similarly, we can make the call from the hotel phone to the any phone or we can just dial the speed dial keys, press the speed dial key and call will be initiated.
and we have six programmable keys through which we can make the call or we can dial through the keypad so now i'll make a call from the hotel phone and you can see the call is received here and we can answer the call so now i'm showing you the phone front side and you can see back side as well this phone has type c usb port for charging mobile phone and we can dial from here thank you for watching this video please subscribe the channel and share the video thank you